Hi Lisa, this is a video to show you how to get into Zoho Mail. So the first thing you're going to do is you can just go on the search and type in Zoho Mail Admin. And that will bring you up. Usually the first one is Zoho Mail Control Panel. Click on that. Then you're going to go up to the right hand corner and click Login. You are going to do your office at comoblacknurseprogram.org and your password is the one that I told you and then click sign in uh, it will say configure SPF you can just X that out for now and then this will be your dashboard and if you're not here you can just click the dashboard and the nav menu on the left hand side and it'll bring you to this. Now if you want to go in to edit some one of your emails you can click on the number and then let's say you want to change someone's password because they don't remember or check on stuff you click on it. You can actually edit a profile and put up a photo if you want. You can change you can add um, addresses and phone numbers if you'd like but you can also go up here along the top navigation menu. It says change login email address, which you probably won't be doing, or change password. At that point, you just need to type in the new password and then type it in again. And then you will uncheck these boxes. Force user to change password and um, I guess I would uncheck that at this point. And then you'll need to put the admin password, which I gave you and we typed in to get into this, in this box, and then press OK, and it'll be good. Uh, that's mostly what you'll want to see on this one. Unless you have a new person that you want to add, and then you will go into, down here on the left side, mail accounts, and then... Uh, nope, I'm sorry, that's wrong. User dashboard. Then go to quick links and click on add user. And now you put in a first name, a last name, and it will sort of populate this automatically, but you can change it. So if right now this was Sarah Land, and it would show up as sarah.land at Como, but they're the volunteer coordinator. You could erase this and write volunteer at Como and then put in your password, confirm password. This is the one you put in. If you keep this checked, it'll force them to put in their own password, or you can put in the password that they want and uncheck this and click OK. I hope that helps. Let me know if you have more questions or if this wasn't any good, and I'll do a new one for you.